<laughs> it is Thursday. Uh, yeah, it is Thursday. I'm like, man, this week going is crazy. It's nine minutes after that, y'all. Y'all nine on the ones and twos. Uh, mixes that'll be in your head all day. I'm so excited this morning, man. Our next guest is a good friend of mine. Who is going to play my song? <laughs> don't, don't make me. Uh, you know, I'll let you go over to that piano now. We can get. We no, can get I'm ready. asking, are you going to play my new song? Absolutely. Oh, Kirk, I didn't know. Kirk, I didn't Kirk, know. You know. I ain't going to have you on the, on the morning show and not play your song. Man, thank you. Thank oh, you, man. Wait. I appreciate that. Man, my, my my this is my brother right here. He is a Grammy. Oh, it's good to know somebody that has won a Grammy. I didn't really one. win one. I what <laughs> what happened was is that I was sometime. Well, okay, I'm gonna tell the Song, truth as a Christian. Oh no, no, let me tell the truth as a Christian. Actor. Oh, let me tell. No, you can act because I was in your. Is video. I go to the Grammys and when people go to the bathroom and they sit their Grammys on on, on the table outside. I take right. Them. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah right, Kurt. Yeah, and I got right, a homeboy. Kurt. I got a homeboy that just got a pen, and he can like, change your name. Okay, so you stole. So you stole. Nineteen. You, so, so you stole forty. So you you stole forty <laughs> Stella Awards, and then you stole nineteen Grammys. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, whatever. Please welcome Kurt Franklin. <laughs> <laughs> And I'm going to tell y'all something. That's one person that I'll avoid. Uh, if there's any gospel artist I'll avoid, it's two people, uh, Kurt Franklin <coughs> and John P. Key. Why? Because they need to be on stage doing stand-up comedy for real, for <laughs> no. real. So, <laughs> How oh, you doing, yeah. King? Man, I'm doing good. How you doing? Man, I'm honored to talk to you, brother. I'm down to talk to you, man. You are, uh, and, uh, you are a survivor, bro. You, yeah. You're, you're a strong man, and... And you know, man, you uplift people by your transparency, letting people see your journey. And man, yeah. it's just really been, you know, just encouraging as we wipe our tears watching you. And man, you know, it's just good to hear your voice, King. No, nah, man, it's good to hear your voice. It's good to be with you and to have you live uh, in the studio. Congratulations on your new single, All Things. Let's start right there. All Things. All Things. All things. All things. All things. And, uh, and now this is your first solo performance in some years. Now tell us about the song and uh, how it felt to work with, a, you know, work on a solo project. Yeah, yeah. Well, you know, I mean, we were with Maverick City last year. And, and what happened was is that, you know, um, Love Theory was the last song I released back in 2019. And, and then, you know, this song woke me up out of my sleep, bro. It just woke me up out of my sleep. I ran to the key. Uh, I got up and, and sat down at the piano naked. <laughs> and, oh yeah, and, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, just want to let y'all know that. That's how it happened. Yeah, yeah. Just want to let y'all know. So if y'all ever come to the house, you're we right, could have done wanna... without knowing that. Yeah, man. You... Well, if you ever come to, <laughs> I'm telling you. So if you ever come to the house, you just may not want to sit on that piano, bitch. <laughs> okay, thank you. Appreciate that. Oh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? You know, that's what a Christian brother should do. The Christian brother should, you know, you know that. He should let you know where the warning signs are. <laughs> hey, Kurt. So, yeah. so you land in the bed, and the song pop up in your head. You got to roll, you got to run to that piano right then before right that then, thought go away. Before it go away, because it will go away. And it so will. I, and so I sat down, man, and it just kind of felt good. And it's like you know, over the next couple of days, God was. What cool the song or the cold bench? <laughs> <laughs> Both. Both. <laughs> Both. <laughs> You know, they call me Little Cheeks. So, you know. Man, <laughs> said, stop. Hey, man. Right, let's talk about the new TV show that you and your wife, Tammy, got. <laughs> let's shift gears to the new TV show called The One. Shout out to Tammy Franklin. Yeah. Shout out to Tammy Franklin. She's the real OG. Absolutely. Yeah, man, we've got this baby show. Shout out to TV One. And I mind you, it's not, it's not a Christian dating show, so don't be thinking that we're gonna have people reading the Book of Leviticus <laughs> and sitting around, yeah. you know, you know, you know, you know, just taking the yeah, Lord's supper. I no, was, I, was, I, was, I was gonna come on there, but y'all ain't finna set me up with nobody with no black stockings and white shoes. <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> it's not a, it's not a Christian dating show. It's just real uh -uh. people. It's real it's life. That <laughs> A bag full of Sunday school books and her ankles crossed. No, sir. No, sir. I'm not coming on that show. But I'm smelling like baby powder. No. Uh -uh. White yeah. diamonds. White diamonds. <laughs> no, man. man. On, this for everybody. On, this for everybody, man. And it's a really, really dope show. It's fun. It's engaging. It's exciting, man. So check it out tonight. It premieres on TV One tonight. It's called The One. That's no man, Kurt. Yeah, go ahead, Kenny. And then I got a music festival popping off in Dallas this weekend, man. It's the third yes. annual, you know, it's, I call it Gospel Coachella. 
It's, I call it gospel Coachella, man. And, you know, uh, the first two years we had it sold out here in Irving, man, and then COVID shut us down. But we're back and bigger than ever, man. We've got Tasha Cops, Leonard Chandler Moore, Tamala Mann, Yolanda Adams. We've got uh, Pastor Mike. We've got Doe. We've got uh, Career. Uh, we've, we've got Kiara Sheard. We've got... Uh, man. Uh, we got Adam Blackstone. You got your boy Kirk. And so, man, we're just going to have a wonderful time. It's going to be super dope this weekend in Irving, Texas. Uh, the Exodus Music Festival, a.k.a. Gospel Coachella. Yes, sir. <clears throat> Kay, what you about to ask? Uh, <laughs> I think we had, I, I'm saying we, are we out of time? Man, okay. okay, yeah, you said that uh, you're, match, you're Mr. Matchmaker because you hooked up a lot of people. Are there yeah. any celebrity couples that you want to take credit for? No, 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 no. I haven't had a chance to hook up any celebrity couples, man. But, you know, as, as I have a couple of marriages up under my belt, you know what I'm saying? A couple of kids have been born because of me. And I, wow. and I make all the people that have kids, they got to put Kirk somewhere in the name of the babies. <laughs> no, I'm playing. They ain't got to do that. Uh, putting that stamp on them? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, so, but, Kirk, but, what yeah. was... The- Kirk, what was the first day that you took your wife on? And I want to come on that show, too, so y'all make sure y'all find a spot for me. Oh, please. Well, first of all, why have you not spoken to me until now? Well, yeah, I've, I've, been, I've been talking for the last five minutes, and now you're going to finally speak. Because you was running your mouth with the man, and he don't let nobody get in, so I'm going to let y'all go oh, ahead. But we ran into each other at the mall in Atlanta. We ran into each other at the mall and showed each other some love. It was just me and you in the mall. Remember, it was We empty. were the only ones in you, the mall. Yeah. I bet you was, was walking. I bet, I bet if you went in the store with him, you was walking fast as I don't know what, because uh, uh, you have to you have to get into a light jaw walking through the mall with Gary. So I stopped going with him. Yeah. No, 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 Gary. Next time, speak to me as soon as I get on this microphone. You understand what I'm saying? I sure will. I <laughs> sure will. <laughs> Getting straight, Kurt. <laughs> but no, man, it's always love. Y'all always show me love. Now, now, what about the first day real quick, Kurt? Well, you know, when I first met Tammy, I met Tammy at a water park when I was 18 years old. And she, had a, and she had a bikini on, and it was nothing spiritual about it. Right? <laughs> nothing spiritual about what I saw. Yeah. You know what? Instead of doing the front page, uh, can we come back out and talk, talk to Kurt some more? Because we yeah, want to know about the first date. I'm yeah, yeah, we don't have to do the front page all the time. Yeah, man. Y'all just bring yeah. some food in. I'm good. What'd you say, Dave? Yeah, we'll play a song. We're going to come back out with more. Kurt, you, you have time, right? Can y'all play that Kurt song? Oh, come oh, on. We're going to play the Kurt song. Yeah, Absolutely. Let's go. Let's go. More Kurt Franklin coming up. Bring us my the morning show. All right, y'all, Rick's Mountain Morning Show. Hey, uh, we got the one and only Kurt Franklin in the building. Kurt, uh, one more big round of applause. Kurt, Kurt Franklin, Franklin in the building. building. What's good, beautiful people? What's good, beautiful people? Hey, man, we, we just happy to have you, man. Now, Kurt, tell us about this new song and, uh, you know, what, 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 get, what get you so, got you so excited about this, you know, this new song? Well, man, you know, so many people right now just need to be able to be reminded of how dope God is and how much power he has in the midst of the negativity. Because sometimes right now it seems like that God is somewhere chilling and ain't paying attention to all the crazy hell that's happening right now. And, and I'm going to tell you, I can understand how that can make a lot of people feel because often I feel that way sometimes myself. But this song is just a reminder that just because he's silent don't mean that he's still. And, and and there's nothing too big or too small that he can't do for his children. And so this is just a simple loving reminder, man, that God can do all things. And uh, Kurt, before we play the song, now let everybody know how you can be followed. Just come to the house. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. Get everybody on social media, man. Um, I'm on Black Planet. You can, no, you can Kurt. Kurt. <laughs> see? Yeah, no, see, see, the, right, see why I be avoiding him yeah, and no. John P. Key? But you know better than asking them doggone questions. You know Kurt. Right. You can find me at Kurt Franklin. It's all love. At Kurt Franklin. At Kurt Franklin. Yeah. All right, y'all. Let's, let's play the song right now. Here we go. All right, Kurt. Love you, man. Love you, King. <laughs> 